Welcome back to Heritage Blades. Uh, this is the part two video of the six inch bowies. I had a little crook in it uh, toward, toward the points. Apparently uh, where I had them annealed and laying there when, as they cooled they may have warped a little bit but I heated them back up, got them straightened out. I went ahead and uh, marked my uh, centers on them, like I said in the previous video, I took a Sharpie. Only one I could find was a black. I like to use red, but the black shows up some, maybe enough to where I can see. But basically, all I done was uh, took a caliper, uh, got thickness, divided that in half, put it, and just marked it with the caliper. Uh, you might not have been able to see that but I just go along like that marking it. We're ready to do some grinding. Uh, I had to do some work to my reconfigure my band or my belt sander back here that way I could get able to get on the top because I believe that's where I'm gonna have to do this style grinding at is right on the wheel. So we'll uh, get back there and uh, start doing some grinding and like I said before when you're using this stuff I always have gloves eye protection and dust mask and so on uh, if you hear music in the background of this video it's my radio I like to play it as I'm working I like music in the background and also if at times if I'm doing this video and all you hear music in the background that's my radio don't pay attention to it and so on and so forth but we'll get to grinding here and uh, see what we come like up I with. Like I said I had to reconfigure my belt grinder here it stood straight up fine as far as flat sanding but I unmounted it, mounted it on a 2 by 12 put hinges on it where I can bring it down like that and I can work off the wheel out here. As you can see, it takes quite a bit of grinding. and that's just with the uh, 35 grit belt. But I brought it down on my mark, kind of kept them both even. I'll get the other and grind down with the 35, then I'll go to 60, then I believe I've got a 120 All right, grit. here we go, I've uh, brought them down. I started out with a 35 grit, then went to 60, then went to 120. And uh, right there's one of them. And there's the other one. It's a bit of a process getting them ground down and so forth. And now it's to the rest of it's hands on. Uh, got some filing to do. Uh, what I'll do is file a, a, a round notch right in there for the sharpening or what I say I forget what they call it but and get the rest of the uh, the backbone uh, shaped up uh, so forth do a little bit. I believe I'll put a like a small drop point on 
on this up here uh, to bring it down to match with the other. On the grind I found when you go at the tips right there, you see see those tips there. Uh, it, they get so thin, so I usually go ahead and do that, then just put a slight drop point on it up here. But there they are. Uh, a little more work we'll to them. We'll start doing some uh, file work and all in the part three. Thanks for watching. Uh, subscribe. Watch the rest of my videos. And enter in that uh, tomahawk drawing. Uh, all you gotta do is go to the Tomahawk video. If you're subscribed, just comment, I'm subscribed. Uh, please enter my name. Uh, if you're not subscribed, click subscribe and comment below. Uh, I'm subscribed, enter my name. Thank you for watching. Uh, stay tuned for part three.